Let's take a look at the function uh, 18 and 19. 18 and 19 are free form functions where you can configure a multiple points on and off, on and off with multiple times. Uh, Non-cycling and 19 is a cycling pattern. To configure them, you can just configure a normal T1 and T2 uh, because we have a multiple uh, times here, up to 100 uh, points. So in order to configure the times for 18 and 19, we need to put the timer into the programming mode, set the function first to 18 or 19, turn the uh, timer off, and then go back into the programming mode. And now the timer realizes it's in the 18 and the 19 and the timing programming would be slightly different. And I'm just gonna show you how to do that. So what I have here is a simple test circuit i have a buttons connected to the timer i have external light connected and i have a nine volt battery you can uh, use internally build led into the timer but for this video due to the lighting you can't really see it so i connected the external light so let's uh, configure the timer the first thing we're going to do is put the timer into the programming mode We're going to skip the timing, push two buttons. Now we're in the function step and we're going to set the function to 18. So we're going to push it 18 times. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we're going to disconnect the power. So now we can put timer back into the programming mode. And there's a some pattern that you want to configure, you know, on and off, on and off, right? For uh, two seconds uh, on, one second off, uh, one second on, five seconds off and so forth. And this is how you're going to uh, push the button for, for that duration. So if you need two second on, you push the button. Two second off, you release the button for two seconds, then you push it for one second, release for one, push for one, release for one, push for five, release for three, and just basically follow your pattern and then disconnect the power. 